Hello everyone, Bill Bacardi. Hopefully everybody's well. Uh, this is just a little bit later from that last lock that I picked from the Lock Picking Patrolman. I uh, took this 83 series core apart. It wasn't working. I locked it up and this key wasn't working it. And I don't know why. Well, I figured out why now. The number six pin, which I have on my board right here. This is going to be a collaboration lock between me and the Lock Picking Patrolman. Uh, it was a little short, so the... The driver was sticking down in the, uh, what you call it, in the uh, key pin. Let's try and put in this vice and see if we can get this picked now, now that it's working again. Put some on the bottom of that keyway. Let's get my Daz Evers here. Let's see what we could do with this thing. Okay. <clears throat> I dropped my tension wrench. Sorry, guys. Uh, you know what? It might... I think I'm in frame. I'm not going to ask. I said I'm going to quit doing that. You know what? I'm way over. Let me get closer to you guys. I am so sorry. I'm going to move the camera just a little bit here. I think that's good. Here. You know what? I'm going to move this back. Here, I'm going to get that close to you guys because I'm not even close to being in frame way back there. I don't know why. That's normally where I'm at. <laughs> okay. So Lock Picking Patrolman has done all of the top pins in this, and I'm going to do all the key pins, guys. I just want to do a little bit of a false set. I think that was three I touched. Ooh, that was a big click on four. But he feels like he's trying to overset me. Okay, nothing on one yet. One is not binding at all. Okay, I just dropped something in the back. So I picked this open. And I figured out that was the number six. We went a little deeper there on two, I think, that that was. Um, I picked it open and figured out it was the number six pin that was a little bit low for that key that's, that was with the lock. So I like the bidding on that key, so we'll we'll keep that. And ooh, I just oh no, I went back into a little false set. I thought I overset that pin, but um, one is giving me counter, but I can't set them. Hmm. Hopefully I can get this done in under 15 minutes so I can take it apart and show you what the lock picking patrolman has put in here and then uh, I'll do all the keeping. Whoa, really deep there now. Um, I'll do all the key pins and then, uh, well, you know what? I'm open. I was stuck on my vice. <laughs> my tension wrench was in there on an angle. It was stuck on my vice. We're open. <laughs> That's awesome. Okay. That's just like an update, like I said, guys. Uh, I, I haven't been doing any videos. I feel like I got a little time tonight, so we'll do some videos. We'll get what I can done, at least for you. And I'll upload them as I can, guys. I'll get one uploaded tonight for sure. Was that shim long enough? I don't think that's long enough. Here's a longer one. Um, I'll definitely get one uploaded this evening. And then we'll get some... I'll try and get the... Another one uploaded tomorrow. Okay, that's all the way in. Now, obviously, on the 83 series, you got to push that little uh, button in there. So we can just get that started on its way out. And then, uh, okay. Stick a follow in it, and we'll take the uppers out. I don't even need to show you the key pins, really, because they're all just stock. But Lock Picking Patrolman has done some nice work in the... On the by on the uh, Bible side of it, guys. Okay, there's all the key pins in and working, guys. You can see. Hey, what's going on? There? See that number six pin was a little bit low. That was in there. I don't want to mix that up. <clears throat> Let me get rid of those so I don't mix them up. <laughs> so yeah, I got it straightened out now. It works very nicely. Uh, they're all standards, so we won't even dump those, guys. I'm sorry. Actually, let's do this and stick it in this core holder that Easy Pickens sent me, which is awesome. It's got my little logo on the side, my little BB on the side of it there. See? All right, let's see what uh, Lock Pink Patrolman's putting at the top of this lock. I think I got the shim out already. What do I do with it? Uh oh. There's a clip off of it. Okay. In one, we have this. I changed this. He had a key pin in here, this little key pin, and it was facing downward. So I changed it out and put a square pin in it. Because the point was facing down, and that's 
Makes it very easy to pick that pin. It's got a steel spring. I think all the springs were the same, if I remember. I just did a little while ago. Oh. Number two is an awesome spool. Factory spool. Three is a T-pin serrated. I'll bring this down to the pinning board and show you these guys. They did a nice, very nice job on these pins. Four is a serrated spool. Uh, serrated, I'm sorry. All the way serrated. Very nicely done. And uh, six is a serrated spool. I don't know if those are factory or where you got those from. Those are really nice pins. Five and six are the same pin with steel springs in them, guys. One's a little loosely wound. One's a little tighter. But nothing done upstairs in the Bible. I'll bring this down real fast to the pinning board, guys. And show you. Okay, so. And then what I'm going to do, I'm going to do all the lower pins, like I said. Okay, so this goes here. This was that key pin that I changed out. See, it was sticking down like this. And I, I just believe that that makes it easier to pick. You let me know if you want me to put that back in there. Lock picking Patrolman, I will, if you want it. To this really nice steel spool here. Steel spring. And then this has got a T-pin on the end of it. Serrated. Uh, hopefully you can see that. Let me turn that sideways. See, it's got a T-pin on the end of it. Very nicely done. All serrated spools. Serrated and then a really spool in the middle. This awesome, really long serrated here. And then uh, two serrated spools in the five and six position. All steel springs, the same springs. And we're going to leave the same springs in it. Uh, but there's a quick over of the pins again. Just a really fast video, guys. Uh, and I'm going to do all the key pins, like I said. And I'll get this sent out. Everyone, thanks for watching. Have a great evening. Thanks for all your support. And good night. Thank you.